Well, it's Memorial Day weekend, the unofficial kickoff to summer. Hopefully you'll have a three-day weekend, or at least you can get outside and enjoy some of what's left of America. But that also means that liberals are trying to ruin things for the rest of us and scare the children by putting a morbidly obese woman on the cover of the famous Sports Illustrated swimsuit edition this year. And just like the Marxists demand that you refer to them by certain pronouns or made-up supposed genders, they're also demanding that you refer to morbidly obese women who are 100 pounds overweight as beautiful. When they posted the cover online, most people's reaction, normal people's reaction was, well, shocked to put it mildly that a magazine known for its beautiful women would put the equivalent of Rosie O'Donnell on the cover as the new standard of beauty. Listen, if you want to see Rosie O'Donnell sunbathing, that's your problem. I mean, you're right. And I'm sure there are plenty of fetish websites out there if that's what you're into. But don't subject the rest of us to it by putting it on the new stand at the grocery store checkout aisle. Guys, get the Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Edition for the same reason that people like to go to a museum. Because they want to see something of exceptional beauty. They don't want to see something ordinary. And they certainly don't want to see something that they see every weekend waddling down the grocery store aisle or at Walmart. And this isn't about fat shaming. You usually don't want to be posting nasty comments about the way someone looks on their social media posts or snickering loud enough so that they can hear you if you happen to see them out in public. And yes, I said usually because there is an exception to that. And that exception is when you're criticizing art. And that's exactly what the cover of the Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Edition is. And in this Orwellian age, I can't even give my honest assessment of this particular piece of art. Otherwise, YouTube will take the video down for bullying and harassment. Things are getting so strange that last year Cosmopolitan Magazine put out these two covers with the cover story that this is healthy. <laughs> no, it's not. This is part of the cultural Marxist plot to destroy the United States and take a contrarian view to everything that's normal and good in order to try to undermine and pervert it. And since we're living in the disinformation age, the thought police continue to claim obvious absurdities are true. Like Amy Schumer is funny and beautiful, and that men can get pregnant and have abortions. Um, what do you say a woman is? I believe that everyone can identify for themselves. Okay. Um, do, do you believe then that men can become pregnant and have abortions? Yes. That was congressional testimony, by the way. So she was literally under oath committing perjury. And now the city of New York allows people to choose an X as their gender on their driver's license. Instead of a male or a female, they can choose an X to signify neither or any of the other supposed 57 different genders that people have invented. And by the way, New York is just the latest state to do this. There's probably at least a half a dozen states, if not more, that did this years ago. The good news is that after years of cowardice, people are finally starting to push back against this. And Ricky Gervais has a new stand-up special on Netflix where he addresses some of this craziness. And I can't show you the clip, otherwise there'll be a copyright issue with Netflix. But basically he jokes that he misses the old-fashioned women, women with wombs, as opposed to the new women, the one with beards and And for subjecting you to the thought of Rosie O'Donnell wearing a swimsuit, I owe you free shipping this weekend in the U.S. off of any of my shirts from my online store, markdice.com. So use the promo code ULTRAMAGA, one word, ULTRAMAGA at the checkout. So head on over to markdice.com and order my new ULTRAMAGA shirt or the classic Liberalism Find a Cure or Save the Triceratops or any of my awesome designs. Get free shipping in the U.S. this weekend by using the promo code ULTRAMAGA at the checkout. So head on over to markdice.com or click the link in the description below and check them out. And now I think we're going to go to ULTRAMAGA. Our country was ultra prosperous, ultra secure, and ultra successful, the most successful our country's ever been. Let's go, Brandon. I agree. <laughs>